Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Minecraft. We'll go up to the library in a bit. I've had feedback on how most of you said you want everything with glass up there, but there's something more important that i got to do first, and we were messing around with those chickens for ages, and I was trying desperately to make the chicken thing work. And I could not get it to work. I could not get the whole chicken thing to work. I have gone and looked it up, and I have found, to my infinite surprise, that there is a way that we can go and do this. And we can actually make the chicken farm work. Now, I didn't type in, when I was searching on YouTube and the internet before, lossless chicken farm. I just put chicken farm. you got to type lossless in and it gives you a different recipe. So what we're going to want to start with is we'll take some of these oak planks and we will make a box like that. That turns it into a chest. We then take that one. We go two down the side and one down there and we make a hopper. We then go and take this one and we go like that and that makes a minecart. And then we put the minecart and the hopper and we make a minecart with a hopper. Then we need to make rails, and I think, is it like that? No, it's not like that. Is it like that? No, uh, I suppose it would actually be with the sticks in the middle, possibly like that. So need to remove those, and then do we go all the way out like that? No, do we go like that? There we go, right. I knew it was like that somehow, so we get 16 rails from that. I didn't want 16, I only wanted one. That's used up uh, quite a bit of iron. I only needed one rail, and it doesn't. it's something that we get back afterwards. So I'm not really thrilled that we've had to use up that much. But, you know, needs must. This, this is what we've got to do. So we're going to put the glass down there. We don't need any other bits. We're going to put the rail there. We're going to put the minecart, the hopper, right there. Okay, so then we can go up to Le Chicken Farm. Actually, before we go to the chicken farm, there is another thing that we got to do because... Well, actually, there's a couple things that we've got to do. We want to have a look in here. I don't think the thing I'm looking for was in... Let's just check these two chests. It's not in that one, and it's not in that one either. Nope. Uh, there's coal in that one, though. I did notice the coal there. Uh, it's not in here. I think I'm going to have to make another one. I know what it is that I'm looking for. I'm just looking to see if I can... Well, I do have a sticky piston. We've got two of those. So we we'll take the sticky piston and we will use that one. I've got the other bit that I need. I'll take a redstone torch. And I'll also grab a little bit of redstone dust. Okay, I think that is now everything that I want for this. Oh, no, there was one other thing. I still still haven't got everything. I need to go and look in there. Uh, oh, actually, I do have everything. I needed a bucket. A bucket was the last item that I wanted. So we'll go up here. And we will go along here. I've got a daylight sensor right there because I was messing around. I cut out an awful lot of the stuff that I was doing. Now, at the moment, that's kind of working. Um, kind of is, and it kind of... It, well, no, it was because... What did we do? We had a different... Oh, no, it was, we, we put a block up there. We did it slightly differently. We put a block up there, didn't we? But anyway, um, I had a daylight sensor that I put down there. I tried all sorts of things. I cut out an awful lot of what I was messing around with, trying to get this thing to work. Um, so a lot of it did end up sort of disappearing and uh, wasn't like active. So to start with, just for a minute, I'm going to remove that little bit of redstone from there. So that it, let's just double check that it does actually do it. Okay, that's still chucking. So why have I got the redstone over here? Let's take out another bit. Maybe I don't need that bit back there. Right, that's now lit up and it's not firing the eggs out. That's all I need. I just wanted it to not fire the eggs out. And there's that birch slab that I had. And then we've got raw chickens in here. We've got some cooked chickens. And we've got a whole load of feathers. We need this to be lossless. That's the whole point of this, that it's supposed to be lossless chicken farm. It's not supposed to do anything else. Now, I could sit and wait for those chickens to hatch. I'm not going to, to hatch to grow 
I'm not going to. I have no desire to go doing that. Uh, what I do have a desire to do is put uh, that down there, and I will climb up. And then I want to go with my bucket, and I want to put that one there like that. And I want to break this bit of glass. Chickens are all going to die, and I'm going to gather that up like that. Hopefully this lot doesn't burn. Let's remove that one there. Right, no fires have started. That's good. So we're, we're, we're making some progress. So I want to remove that one, and then... I want to get rid of that chicken. And get rid of that chicken. Okay, so we've gotten rid of the two chickens. I then want to remove that one so that we're down below here. And next, I'm going to put oak planks on there. And I'm going to put oak planks on here. And then I'm going to put oak planks up there like that. And I'm going to put on here, I'm going to put a rail in there. Now, the next bit is a bit tricky. I don't want to get in the way of the chickens. But I need to kind of remove that. I might be able to do it without removing anything over there. I want to put the minecart with hopper now. In, yes, I can actually do it like that. Right, that's good. Uh, I want to put that one in there. This one here, I actually, well, that's got to stay open because i got to be able to go in underneath it. So we want to go up here. Now, you need to remove the, uh, remove that first like that. Then we want to go back down here. Now, what I'm, I'm going to just place that one in there a minute. And then I'm going to come over here. I'm going to bounce up like that. And now I want to get and remove the block that is under there. Not those. Didn't want to do that. I was also using the wrong item to do that with, unfortunately. So let's jump back and let's try that again. I want to put... The rail on there. And, ooh, actually, can I do it like this? Can I remove... No, I can't. Right, that doesn't work. There is a way to do it. I've done it. I have done it several times. So we'll, we'll just put in that block in there. We'll put the railway. We'll put the cart on the top. We will go with the axe here. Oh, I know how to do it. I have a half slab. Put a half slab in there. You know, I don't even need to do it with that half slab. I can do it with the original half slab that we had there before, which is one of these. And I'm going to pop that one down there like that. So just pick up these items. And then what I can do is I can go underneath here and I can remove that one so that that minecart with hopper slides down into there. That's what we're trying to achieve here. That's what we want. We just want that bit to go in there like that and then do nothing else. Now what I need to do is I need to remove that one and I want to put another one down there like that. Then I want to... In order to make this work properly, I'll just pop one there like that because I've got to be able to face this way to do this. I want a sticky piston like that. And oops, it's not actually a sticky piston there, is it? Uh, we'll remove that one. I'll put slab there so that then I can put the sticky piston on the back, but it's not put it on the back. Why, aren't you, why haven't you put it on the right side? I'm going to have to come down here and remove this piece and do it from down here then. Okay, so I'll remove you, and then I'll come over here, and I'll take that sticky piston, and I'll... There we go, that's what I want. I want the sticky piston to face that way. And then I can remove that one. That's fine. And then I can place down on here. We'll just add in another one of them, and then I can go with the redstone torch back here. I don't think I actually need any redstone dust to do this. Put that one there. And did you see that? What that did was that pushed that half slab into that minecart. That's what we were looking to achieve right there. That, that's all we wanted to do was put that half slab inside the minecart in there. So now I can remove this. I don't want this here anymore. This is all done and dusted. So I'm, I'm finished with that bit. 
finished with that bit in there. There's nothing else that I need to do in here apart from put the block of glass back in there. And then I'll go up here like this and I need to do this quickly. I want to put that one over and we go. We put that in there and we put... Not that. That was stupid. Uh... Change this over before we cook. Go to there and put that in there like that. There we go. So I've got the lava carefully encased. I haven't actually fried anything. But what I've got now is that I haven't just got the hopper in underneath. I've got the hopper up there. And so when the chicken grows and then gets burned by the lava and it drops the cooked chicken... What's happening at the moment is the majority of that cooked chicken is getting fried by the lava up there. But because this hopper is so close to it, it will now grab the chicken and remove it. So then it will just bring it straight down and dump it into the chest. So we'll just remove this lot and that bit of raw chicken there as well. Um, actually, I'm going to take all of the chicken. I'm going to leave the feathers there. We've got two stacks and 37 feathers in there. And that's it. That's all we need to do. You just add a minecart with a hopper. There's nothing else. In, in order to make it work properly, you do have to push that slab into it. And that's the only other bit that you've got to do. So it, it's actually relatively simple to make this work. So we will pop that up there. And now we will put a bit of redstone, put a bit of redstone. And there's loads and loads of eggs in here already. So we will just... Right, I don't know why some of those chickens are dying. I think they're being pushed out too far. There is a chicken in there. He's in that minecart hop. I have tested this and it did work. Right, I tested it and it did work. So quite why we've got some of those chickens coming out and then burning up in the lava, I don't really know. That shouldn't... Well, I didn't see it happening before. I, d I did do a lot of... It might just be that when they were spawned, they jumped up a little bit too high. But, I mean, they, they lay eggs pretty quick here. So, we should be able to see that one in action again. And then see the whole thing. I tested this and it worked. Tested this quite e extensively. And it worked. So, it, it, it cannot go turning around now and saying, No, I don't like this. I'm not going to work. There's a lot of chickens around here. I'm going to grab these chickens, and I am, um, that down here is just, that was the other area that I was going to make. I've got three eggs in here, and there is another dead chicken. There is, ah, all of these chickens that we've been getting, this is where they've all escaped. I knew that there were more chickens around, I just wasn't sure quite where they'd gotten to. There's one, there's another one, where are they all hiding? Which means that there's going to be some more eggs around here as well. They, they, wow. Okay. There's, <laughs> there's a lot of chickens around. There is an awful lot of chickens around here. <laughs> oh, this is, look at them all. Right. Well, at least we're getting rid of some of these chickens. This is good. We, we want to keep doing that. We want to sort of keep shaving back the number of chickens here. And I got a load of eggs just th there. Right, now they're coming out and they're burning. This shouldn't be happening. Have I got that minecart the wrong way round? Don't think there was a wrong way round for it. I mean, knowing my luck with things that we've done so far, that would not surprise me in the slightest. But I, I, I tested this over and over and over and it worked. It actually worked. I got the thing to work. So why are the chickens now spawning and dying? This, this... Oh, this is making me very up there. I wonder if it's because that one chicken in there is pushing all of the others up. Because he's buried. I'm wondering if maybe that one chicken is causing this problem. Wouldn't surprise me, actually. He could be the root cause of this problem. That single solitary chicken in there could be all of our problems. 
So I'm going to come in here. I can't. I can hit. Oh, great. I broke it. Well, that work, and it's for nothing. I've got to get the minecart back in here, which means I've got to go and do the whole thing again. So let's just remove that so it stops firing a minute. I can do this quickly now. We know how this works, so we just need to remove the lava. We need to remove that one. We need to remove that block of glass up there. And then we can put down... Let's try putting a block of glass down here. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go over this way and I'm going to put these two in here and I'm going to put that one and I'm going to put the minecart facing in this direction. So I'm going to put in a bit of wood in there and then I'm going to put the railway down like that. Uh, we will pop you on there and then the minecart is in that chest. So I need to actually go and get the chest, get the stuff out. There we go. We get the minecart. Uh, we can take that out as well. Right. So thus, everything in there is fine. I don't actually need to be back round the front now. I've put the railway in that way round. So we'll put that bit of glass back and we'll come over this side and do it. So then we can go and take the... I want to remove that one and I want to put a half slab in the bottom of that one. Right there, so I can reach over and break the stuff that I need to. Uh, then I want to pop that one in there. Put you on there. That is different, isn't it? You look at that. I wonder if maybe it was because I had it the other way round, and that is what stopped it from working. So it could very well be that the minecart does have to be facing in a particular direction to get this to work. It does kind of make sense, because oh, I don't remember how I was testing it. Anyway, let's drop the minecart in where it's supposed to be. That's supposed to be in there. Now I need to shove this into there. That's fairly easy and straightforward. We've done that now. So we go over to here. We go and take this one. We put it down here. Um, and I drop the sticky piston in there like that. And then I have an oak plank here. Actually, let's have the glass. I'm going to want the glass, aren't I? Uh, so we put an oak plank in there like that. And then we get a redstone torch over here. And we have that one and we drop it. No, we don't put it there. We have to put it directly behind. So we put a plank and we put that one in and we shove that in like that. Remove you. Uh, remove that one. Then have an axe and remove these items so that they are out of the way. And then I can have uh, lava up there, glass and glass in there. And that is everything. Okay, so now we've got it actually, I'm hoping, fixed. So then I can go back over here and I can take... The redstone, how much have we got? we got 17 eggs in there. I'm hoping that's enough to at least get one or two chickens. There's one. He jumped up. We've got any more. Right, that one chicken went straight up into the lava. I seen this done like two dozen times and it was working perfectly. Don't tell me that this isn't going to work now for no particular reason other than for some reason the chicken farm seems to hate me. I have watched these demonstrations for how these things work over and over and over. I've watched lots of videos. I've seen how they work. This normal one, I've seen it work. I've seen the one with the block of granite above it. I've seen that work. And now I've seen this one work. And it's not working! Why doesn't it work for me? It works for everybody else. What have I done wrong? I've done nothing to deserve this. I really have done nothing to deserve this. Why? I've been sat here for ages watching this. It worked when I tried it out before. It hasn't worked now. I got one chicken in there and all the rest have jumped in there and died. So there is one alternative that I'm going to try just to see if we can get something out of this to actually work. Otherwise, we're going to just go back to remove that one and keep it how it was. Um, but we hardly get any drops because the lava takes it all. Um, 
I'm I'm sort of at a bit of a loss as to what to do with this chicken farm, really. The, the, the whole killing thing just doesn't... Like, I see these things that are supposed to work. I'm seeing these different videos that are actually supposed to work, and for some reason, it's not working for me. I can't get these things to work, and it makes no logical sense to me whatsoever. I, I have watched these work, and I have seen them actually doing what they're supposed to do, and yet every time I try them in here, they just fail to do anything whatsoever. And i got to be honest, it's getting a bit frustrating. So we're going to try one more thing, and if this doesn't work, I, I don't really know what I'm going to do. I am just going to pick up all of that lot right there, and then I'm going to take out that one and that one and that one up there. We're going to remove these two here, and we're going to put them out like that. We're going to put a chest down there in the ground. We're going to, so that one is going to go there like that. And then I'm going to go over this way. And I want to put a hopper into the back of that chest. So I need to go over here. We'll do it from this side. Uh, if I break that one and that one. And I will put my hopper into that chest right there. Then I'm going to put down on here. Uh, I'll put that one on there. And then I will put a half slab down here a minute. That one's going to go there like that. I'm going... I don't think it matters which way round. I have the railway down here. Um, so I'm going to put that one there. And then I'm going to take the minecart with the hopper. And I'm going to pop that one up on there like that. Uh, then I will take an axe and I'll remove that. So we've got the minecart with... Probably should have put glass here first. Let's get rid of that one a minute. Take those back out. And let's actually put a block of glass there in the way. Just for a minute. Just for something to do. There, like that. And then let's try this again. So we want to put that one down there. And then I want to put a railway down here. Let's move that up there. I want to put a rail on there. I want to put the minecart and the hopper up on there. I want to remove that so that drops in there like that. So that's now, hopefully, held in place down there. And it shouldn't go anywhere. Now, in theory, that hopper is slightly higher up and... The, the whole idea was that it was supposed to be inside that bit, but that doesn't seem to have worked. And I don't know why that didn't work. Like, it, it was supposed to be right in there, and that's where it was supposed to be able to grab everything. I wonder if shoving that into it would actually help. That does, Is that going to lift it up ever so slightly? If I was to remove that slab and then shove that out the way? That wasn't how the thing worked that I see. They were inside the hopper, inside that slab. That's how it worked, right? That is exactly how it worked, and there's no reason that it shouldn't do it now. I'm just going to pop that piece of glass in there, and then I'm going to go up there with the lava, like this. So I'll put... Lava up there, glass there, and glass there. So, see, that hopper is now lower down. It used to be directly below. This, this is wrong. That's not how this should work. That's not, that, that's just not going to work. That, 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 there's no way that this right here is going to be able to do anything at all. Right, we put the chicken out there. It, it doesn't have a high enough hopper on it to be able to grab the drops from the chickens. The chickens are spawning again, but that hopper down there is too low. That's not going to be able to reach anything, is it? Guarantee it, that's not going to be able to reach anything. And so this whole system here isn't going to work, not in the slightest. I'm going to take those out of there. Um, right, well... Yeah, that's definitely not what i seen. It, it was in there! This is so frustrating. 
I'm just thinking that one where it is, I do know that underneath a full slab that one would be all right. Uh, I've, I've seen those work before underneath full slab. I'm just wondering um, if maybe I should move it up a little bit because I had a railway working before underneath a wheat farm and so it would pull through a full slab but the, the point of this is it's supposed to be high enough to pull the stuff down under the lava and it isn't going to be high enough down there to pull the drop out of the lava. And this is what, it's not like that, it was how I had it before, but for some reason this whole system doesn't seem to be working right. And I cannot fathom this for the life of me, so I'm going to leave that. I'm just going to give up on it for a minute. And I'm, there's one thing that I do want to have a look at though, and that is in here. Maybe I have got the wrong, see, dropper right there and dispenser. Am I using the wrong item here? Because that's the one that's with the, the bow. And then the dropper right here is just like that. And I'm wondering if I'm using the wrong item in the chicken farm. Because I've got... I've got a dispenser and not a dropper. And that's... They, they, they are different. They are actually different, aren't they? So let's let's go and have a look. Because that one right there, that's like the, the happy face. And then you got the one up here, which is the surprised face. And if you go and have a look up this way. And we look in. He's, he's not the surprised face, sorry. He's the happy face as well. So that is a dispenser in there. And I wonder if I'm supposed to do it with a dropper rather than a dispenser. Whether that would make it... I don't think it does. It's supposed to shoot the eggs out. That's what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to shoot the eggs out so that it can be used. And so we go into here. And I've got the dropper right there. But I wonder if maybe... Did I say... No, dispenser. So I'm wondering if maybe we should try it with a dropper. So I'm going to just try and make one of these a minute. Oops. No, I didn't want to do that. I'm just going to take that one. And I'm going to attempt to swap over the two items. And we will see if we can put a dropper in there instead of a dispenser. And see if that actually does it. Because this isn't going to work. That's not going to work. That's that's absolutely not going to do it. But I'm not going to bother showing you all of this because I have been doing this and doing this and doing this and doing this. And you're probably getting fed up with it. So I am just going to slaughter everything in here a minute. And how can I do that carefully without having all those chickens escape but remove that block? I don't think I can. It's going to be a bit more difficult. We've got all of that in there. If I was to go there and remove that. And then pop that one in. What just happened there? I think I've just burned up my minecart. Unfortunately. So I'm going to go up there like that. And I'm going to... Well, unfortunately, folks, that is all we have got time for today. If you have time, do please consider checking out the links in the description down below. There is one for Nitrado, who provide gaming servers, including but not limited to Minecraft and Farming Simulator. And there is also Fanatical, who sell vast quantities of computer games at very reasonable prices. There is also a discount code in the description alongside the link. If you've enjoyed this video, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.